Hello everyone, this is Leah from Kali, and this is a quick video to show students how to set up their Google Drive. Google Drive is one of our Google Apps for Education tools that all students have access to once they enroll in their first course. To log into Google Drive, all you have to do is go to the portal, log in, and then click on the Google Drive icon. You're going to have access to your Google Drive account even after you graduate. So you want to make sure you start off on the right foot and set it up in a great way so that you can constantly come back to it, know where things are, and continue to add to it even after you graduate. So let's go ahead and get started. This is our Kali recommended way of setting up your Google Drive account. First thing you want to do is click on the new button and then add a folder. Now even though you might have folders and files in here, that's absolutely fine. We're going to start fresh with a new folder. We do have other tutorials in our Google Apps for Education wiki that show you how to move folders and files around. So if you wanted to move any existing folders and files into the folder we're about to create, just go and check out one of those tutorials. Now you get this screen and we want to name it. But let's think fast. We either want to name it Bachelors or Masters. And then Create. Now inside of this folder, and note I just double clicked to get inside of this folder, I want to go ahead and start creating semester folders. So let's go ahead and create a folder for the upcoming semester. Now double click. And let's start setting up folders for all of the courses we're going to be taking in the spring. Once we have all of the folders set up for all of the classes we're going to be taking that semester, what we want to start to do is build out those folders according to the syllabi that we have. So in the case of EDU 122, I'm just going to click on it to get inside. I know that there are four modules in this class, so I want to build out folders for each module. Once all of my folders are created for each of the modules, I can then start to build out other folders inside of those folders. Now, if you're not sure what kinds of folders you're going to need inside each of your course folders, don't worry about it. You can always create them on the fly, and you can always move things around and delete old folders. So let's take a look at what we've done, and note we can follow our breadcrumbs to kind of backtrack and see what we created. So we created module folders inside of course folders, and the course folders we created inside of semester folders. All of the semester folders actually are going into a degree folder, and that degree folder is found within our main Google Drive area. We hope this tutorial was helpful for you, and happy organizing!